Okay, so if you're watching this video right now, that means you're either on my YouTube channel or you are currently reading Black Boy Create um, and you just finished the chapter that talks about creating a content strategy as well as building a vision for your life, okay? So why is building a vision important? I'm a visual person, right? And I personally believe that building a vision, right, or mapping out kind of what you wanna manifest in your life, what you want to happen, what you want the future you to look like is what's gonna help you create that focus and direction that you need to know that you're making the next best step, right? So what does that look like? I personally like to create something like this, which is what I call a mood board. Well, everyone calls it a mood board. Um, and this is just essentially a visual map of how you see life unfolding, but in visual terms, right? So some people like to write down their goals in journals or on whiteboards, and it's usually in text, but for me, I like to create something visual that reminds me what, what the aesthetic, what the look and what the feel is of the life that I'm trying to create. All right, so just to give you a quick tour of my vision board, as you can see, I have tons and tons of magazine clippings of images, pictures, um, as well as like words of affirmation. I think this is actually probably the most important part. So you'll see I have like success is what you make it, started from the bottom, um, what moves you, what moves you makes you 2.0 to kind of speak to being a new version. Um, the choice is yours and it's simple, right? I'm someone that's really about mindset and what, what the story is that you're telling yourself. Uh, leaders create leaders. Spirit lives on. Got my Louis Vuitton luggage, right? I'm manifesting a luxury travel life. I love to travel. Um, so what you put on here is up to you. But I think the key is, um, is making sure that you understand that Doing something like this doesn't need to be challenging, right? All I did was find, this is literally like an old box um, that I had lying around my house that I use as my poster board base. Got my scissors at home. And then honestly, magazines. Magazines are laying all around your house. Ask your mom, ask your dad, ask your brother, your sister. Um, GQ is one of my favorites. So I take a lot of my visual references from GQ magazine. <clears throat> Got my LeBron James here, Travis Scott, Lil Nas, Diddy, that's my guy. In the other magazine that I always read is Entrepreneur, right? So again, I am very visual and I need to see things that keep me going. Along your journey, there's gonna be times where it feels challenging. There's gonna be times where you're super frustrated and you just wanna give up, right? And it's gonna be hard, honestly, for anything to convince you to keep going, which is why it's always great to have something that brings you back to your why, okay? So this is your big why in visual form, something you can hang up nice and big in your room that you're gonna wake up to, go to sleep to, and just remember what it is that you're trying to go out there and make happen, all right? So you guys, make yourself some vision board and I want you to use the hashtag support creative black boys and share them with me.